Hi everybody, I'm Chris Donovan and I'm a sales associate with Lightspeed Financial Services Group. In today's quick video, we will be discussing Lightspeed Trader's Complex Options Order Entry feature. To get started, open up your Complex Option Order Entry window. You can access this from the new drop-down tab on the index bar. Once you've got your Complex Options Order Entry window open, be certain that you also have an Option Level 2 window and an Option Chain window open. You can access these also from the new tab drop down menu from the index bar. In this video, we will be creating a complex option order with multiple legs. Enter the ticker of the stock you'd like to place an options order on in your option level two window. For the sake of the example, we will be using Tesla. Your option chain window will then populate with a list of calls and puts that you can choose from. I'm going to buy the December 11th 605 call and sell the December 11th 620 put and add an equity leg to the option order as well. To add an option to the complex options order entry window, you can manually click through each drop down and select from the list of choices. However, I find it easier and more convenient to go about it in a different way. The other way to add options to your complex order entry window is by right-clicking the call or put you'd like to add from the option chain window. I'm going to choose add selected options to COE for both options I want to have in the order. Remember, I'm going to be buying the December 11th 605 call and selling the December 11th 620 put and I'm going to be adding an equity leg as well. You may also have noticed that Lightspeed offers an add option strategy to COE choice in the right click menu. If you mouse over this, you will see what's available to you from the next menu. In this case, you can see covered call is a possible selection. However, we're not going to address this in this video. After you've entered the call and put into your complex order entry window, make sure to select buy or sell from the side dropdown for each option. Remember, we're going to be buying the call and selling the put. Now, for the equity leg of our complex option order, to get started on this part of the order, go ahead and click on the add equity leg button towards the top of the complex options order entry window. You'll notice that an equity leg section has now appeared in the window. For this video, we're going to sell short since currently there are no shares of Tesla owned in this account. 100 shares on the bid. Mouse over to the side column and choose sell. The default is to place the order on the bid here. You can see that as the bid price changes, so too does the price of the order. A useful feature provided by the complex options order entry window is the ability to save the spread you've created for use at a later time. If you'd like to save the complex order we've created in this video, click on the Save As button toward the top of the left-hand corner of the window. Go ahead and give the order a name. In my case, I'll call the order Elon Spread. When you're ready to place your order, click Go in the upper right-hand part of the window. You'll now see my orders window and positions window have populated from the order I placed. Now, if I'd like to place the same order that we just put together here later today, I can save time by just clicking on the drop down button that says spreads located next to the Save As button and selecting the Elon spread.
please keep in mind that the save orders save the ticker that you had selected for the order. So in this case, when I make that selection, the order will populate for the Tesla options from before. That's all for this video. Thanks for watching.